hi guys welcome back to my channel i'm back with another video and today i am going to be doing my makeup so it's the new year happy new year to everyone so i thought i should start with an updated makeup routine because i haven't done a makeup video in like months now and my makeup routine has changed a lot like i'm still using some of like the same products that i was using on my last videos but the techniques and the application and everything has changed a lot like i'm more on like the minimalist makeup and yeah it has changed a lot so i hope you guys will enjoy this video and if you don't like wearing a lot of makeup i feel like this video is gonna be for you i just washed my face i did apply a little bit of moisturizer and my lips are feeling a little bit dry so i'm just going to apply some chopstick this is and this is like a Batsby peppermint chopstick which is my favorite next i am going to apply some spf like sunscreen we are in the middle of summer here in south africa like it's really really hot and i like to apply my sunscreen all the time and this is the nivea anti-age q10 So I'm going to start with my eyebrows and I'm using this Catrice eyebrow pencil and this is the Catrice eyebrow stylist which looks like this and this one is in dark brown so I'm just gonna start by using the little spoolie to brush my eyebrows in place so, and I'm gonna fill them in lightly I'm not really like doing a lot I'm just feeling like the missing spots just kind of like shape them And next I am taking um, this got to be little um, gel and I like to use it to set my eyebrows so with the same uh, spoolie on the side here I'm just going to get a little bit of gel like so and kind of like rub it on my hand here and go ahead and set my eyebrows My eyebrows don't move at all when I do this. It works so much better than normal like eyebrow gel. So next I'm going to clean around my eyebrows and I'm using this LA Girl Pro Concealer and this one is in toast. So I'm just taking a little bit on like a, a brush here. So now I am done with my eyebrows and this is how they look. I am going to take the same concealer and I'm going to apply this on my face. So I'm going to start by applying around my nose because I have like some um, discoloration there. I'm going to apply some here on my cheeks and around my mouth. And I'm also going to use this concealer to apply under my eyes for like a highlighting situation. Um.
photo and on my eyelids as well because I have discoloration there as well and a little bit on my forehead and I'm taking my beauty blender which is damp and I'm going to blend everything So the key here is blending like you just want to make sure that everything is like seamless and as you can see i'm taking whatever is left on the sponge i'm blending it all over my face as well so this is basically like my base done i am not applying foundation i'm just blending this concealer everywhere now i'm moving to contouring and i'm using this revolution foundation stick and this one is an f18 so i'm just taking it on like a brush here so first i'm going to contour around my cheeks okay. around my forehead here and with whatever is left on the brush, I'm going to contour around my nose. And to blend this out, I'm just taking like a contour brush. And I am taking back my beauty blender and I'm going to blend out around my nose. Blend this contour here. And next I'm taking another LA Girl Pro Concealer and this one is in Fawn. So I'm going to apply this on the bridge of my nose and under my eyes. And I'm applying like a little bit, not a lot just to brighten up that area a little bit more so i'm just doing like a few dots there and um also like a bridge of my nose and a little bit of my forehead and i'm taking like a little blending brush and just blend this in like blend it i'm not petting it i'm like blending it in and I also like to take it like around my nose here And then I'm just going to go back with my beauty blender again. Like I use this thing a lot. So I'm going to blend everything together now. Just to get rid of any like harsh lines. Especially like where the highlight and the contour meet. There. And around on my forehead.
and now it's time to set my face i am using my yadli loose powder and this one is in caramelized so first i am taking the same beauty blender again and i'm taking like a little bit of powder with the beauty blender here to set under my eyes because i do get creases there and on my eyelids as well so i'm not really like baking i'm setting and next i'm taking the same powder and a big uh, powder brush and i just dip it in the powder like so. take off the excess and I'm going to set my entire face with this powder as well. And next I'm applying some blush and this one is by Yadley and this is Sunset Safari, Safari Sunset. It's my favorite blush. And I'm just um, taking some of it on the brush here and applying it on top of the contour. So I'm taking like this little Essence uh, shadow palette and this one is in Dose of Energy. And I'm taking the dark shade here. So. And I'm going to blend this all over my eyelid and like blend it out because it's really really like pigmented but I don't want it to look really really dark that's why I'm using like a big blending brush so I want it to be like blended like sort of like small good but like super blended And next I'm taking my favorite mascara which is the Maybelline Lash Sensational and I'm going to coat both my top and bottom lashes with it. So I don't normally wear lashes every day but when I'm filming that's when I wear lashes and these are my favorite lashes these are the Adele Demis so I'm going to apply them on using this kiss glue and it's a clear one so lashes are done and the next I'm moving to the lips I'm going to be applying this essence extreme shine um, lip gloss and this one is in the shade I don't know but it's like a mauve uh, brownie color so I just like to apply this sometimes I will add a, a lip liner so I'm gonna go ahead and finish my hair and then I will come back and show you guys the final results with the hair done and everything so stay tuned I'm back now and this is the final makeup look I love how it's natural like it looks just like my skin it's not a lot of makeup but there is some definition and I love it so I will link all the products that I used in the description box below and if you like this video don't forget to thumbs up and do let me know in the comment section if you like the more natural simple makeup or you like the full glam and do subscribe to my channel if you haven't subscribed and don't forget to enable the notification bell and I'll see you guys in the next one Bye.